Croatia joins the EU as the 28th member state next month, and its commissioner-designate for consumer affairs, Nevin Mimica, is going through the confirmation process here at the European Parliament. Now, joining us to discuss this is the EPP Group's Andreas Schwab. Mr. Schwab, you are on the Internal Markets and Consumer Affairs Committee. Mr. Mimica went before your committee. What are your impressions from that appearance? I mean, the, the general impression is that Mr. Mimica is a very serious person, having served as Deputy Prime Minister and as a diplomat. But unfortunately, very often his answers were not very satisfying and lacked a little bit political clarity and political commitment. And we believe that we need, in this time of crisis, commissioners with full political commitment uh, and with full personal uh, capacity also in the European Commission, in a college of 28 commissioners. And therefore, we want to have a follow-up to this meeting to make clear that vague answers, that two vague answers, are not a solution. So are you suggesting that he's lacking the credentials to be the commissioner for consumer affairs? No, I, I don't think that he lacks the credentials, but I think that he lacks a little bit the need to be, uh, to be uh, in a position of total political commitment in favor of the European Union and the ability to communicate that. I think we may have to make clear as a parliament that we demand that and I'm sure that he will answer positively on this demand. What are the key issues that he faces and how can the EPP group influence that policy? You are of a different political affiliation clearly said that we expect him to enforce already existing European laws. And we have plenty of European laws that are already existing, but that they are applied in 28 different ways in 28 different countries. And that's not what we aim at in the European Union. We don't need new proposals. We don't need new directives. We need an application, a very serious and uniform application of the directives in place in all 28 different member states. And I think here he was lacking a co concrete commitment to go for specific directives to check their implementation. Can you give me a specific example of that? I mean, he was very vague by saying that he's in favor of a better enforcement without giving clear indicators where and when he wants to start with. But consumers will not wait for him to start his job. Consumers want in reality that their rights are really taken seriously and therefore we have to put more pressure on him to be very clear on starting this enforcement procedure as quickly as possible when in office.